Hello people, welcome in, got a daddy Sudoku here, challenged on the 16th of the 1st, 2021, um, yells truly, um, is doing it, I do like to start out putting as many digits in as possible by the method I call eyeballing it, um, and it just makes things a little bit easier, and less notes, and I will put sporadic notes around uh, a little bit further in. You'll find that I start using notes more and more um, to get it done. Uh, I think too many notes can add up to confusion. That's just, yeah. By the way, I do intend to actually be able to edit these on the PC again. Um, yeah, and I'll be putting some music underneath from one of my lovely moderators, actually. And she started to upload um, stuff to her channel. So go check her out. Go Fish Office. The link is in the description. You see that little message that appeared on screen before about that hint with the number one beside it? Right beside the thing that looks like a flag, but it's actually the NZTV logo. That is the hint for this puzzle. It can cause undue stress. As in, I hit that thing and it changes to something I totally don't expect it to for that box. I'm absolutely baffled and it takes a lot longer for me to solve it. Um, yeah. You will see it get to a point where I do make a fatal. If you can spot the fatal before the, the title comes up, please leave me a comment below. Because, oh yeah, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be grabbing the best comment out of there, and I'm gonna be pinning it. And if you can spot it and tell me where it should, where that number should be, in relation to the, um, to that box, at the time, leave that in the comments. I'll definitely acknowledge you. I like to think I at least acknowledge everyone who comments. If you're just going to drop random freaking Asian porn links in the comments, turn around and do the world a favour. Get the fuck off YouTube. That was almost, that was almost fatal, that one. Putting an 8 up the top instead of a 3. Uh, for those wondering, yes, this is just a standard Sudoku. No extra rules or constraints apply. Uh, it's medium level quality. But it's one of the slightly easier mediums. Coming out in the next day or two, I will have a uh, slightly harder quality one for you. But it's still it's still classified medium on this app I've got. But it's almost more of a low a low hard level. It's. Yeah, it's not as easy as what this is.
you might have been able to hear the wind throughout this, um, but that's because it's reasonably windy where I am, and I've got the door open, so... As you can see, I've kind of become stuck. I'm unsure where to go next, and just putting some notes for an eight in. Um, but that point I become stuck is probably where I made the mistake. I can't exactly track it, but yeah. And the other game with these puzzles is a lot of the time they're okay, they look okay until they're not. And there's two statuses. They're either okay or good or they're not okay. Uh, which means you've got some troubleshooting to do. And... I've got a funny feeling there's a spot coming up where there's a little bit of troubleshooting going to have to happen. Now I think that may be the spot, I'm not entirely sure. I do realise that there's enough room on screen for my face, but I unfortunately am using an app to record this that if I was to put my face on screen, it would show up with the puzzle. Now, I'm not sure that the puzzle actually supports going on to side. I'll have to find that one out. So you can see that there's a fatal mistake. If you can recognise what one it is, comment below. Comment what number's wrong, what square and what box is wrong. I do like to try and do my own troubleshooting before I undo it and give it another shot, but... As you can, as you'll probably see in this troubleshooting area, it didn't quite work out to plan. At the moment, what I'm doing, I'm just going through everything and deciding what other number I could switch out for it. There's not that many, trust me. There's not that many. I thought I was going to take a bit longer to troubleshoot, but yeah, maybe not. I think the undo button might come in handy. 
quick. Rewind. Oh, am I still in troubleshooting mode? Must still be in troubleshooting mode. Unfortunately, I am recording the the voiceover the next day. I wish I could have been doing this the same day, but yeah, didn't work out. Thinking, thinking. Where's my Undo button, where's my undo button? And then yes, I'm bouncing around a little bit, trying to have a look, see where I've gone wrong, etc, etc. Looks all good, but it's not. We've got a little mum, someone doing some edging around the place, so you're gonna have to excuse the weed eater. Yeah, nah, that didn't work, that just worked even worse. So, shoot. I'm making some weird, crazy, dumb ass moves on this puzzle at the moment. I'm not going to bore you guys out by going live with with uh, one of these puzzles because it takes forever for me to do. So my chill out live channel where this is going uh, where this may end up is gonna yeah. As you see, I've taken it right back to the notes, and now it's time for me to figure things out again. I think I think my ones were huge time and wrong, so. Yeah, I'll come to notes and go some nines. The other thing is, I'm putting, I'm tr I try to put a maximum of three, three options for where each number could go in the box. Maximum of three. At the moment, I'm just using two, and it seems to be working pretty okay. So, notes are off. I'm thinking that's probably where the one should go. Right now. Because I've got no other option for it, really. Unfortunately, me who was doing this puzzle didn't figure that one out.
this is um, sudoku.com uh, puzzle app so I'll leave a link to the website and the uh, Android and Apple versions on the description if you're interested in getting it so random sudokus every day randomly generated um, no, by far one of the toughest challenges out there is some of the harder ones some of you more mathematically logically minded idiots out there who enjoy doing sudokus may just enjoy enjoy doing this um and worst comes to the worst, you can always go over to Cracking the Cryptics channel and use the link in the description to get the classic Sudoku app, which is about eight or nine New Zealand dollars at the current moment on the Google Play Store. And yeah, on that note, I've finished the puzzle, and I would like to say a big thank you. For to everyone watching, the puzzle took me 20 minutes, 20 minutes and 16 seconds. Uh, yeah, nowhere near my best time. And yeah, stick around for future stuff happening because there's going to be a lot of it. See ya.